So in the future, kids will learn <coughs> to speak a new way. When you see an airplane without wings, instead of saying, it'll never fly, it doesn't have any wings. The question is, how do you propose to lift off the ground without wings? Does that make sense? Yeah. You want to inquire by the guy that's working. And the guy says, someday you'll have television. How can you do that? That's impossible. That is not inquiry. How do you, how do you project an image on a screen? How would you do it? That's the, and the guy doesn't know technology, he doesn't even know what question to ask. That's why people in government don't even know what the question is. They, they think if people use drugs, say no to drugs. That is not an answer, that's a wish. When they say, when man dies, there must be more to life than that, he must go on, you know, into another world. His soul leaves the body and goes to another world. Now, in the other world, everything is established. There's no money in heaven, according to the Bible. There's no social stratification, no poverty, but angels fly around with wings. If they flew around without wings, that would be a miracle. What do you need wings to fly for? Yeah. You know. So, uh, heaven didn't make sense because it says in some Bibles, we were put here to worship God, to say how great thou art, how wonderful thou art. Well, this is a big fucking egotist that, that would make you to worship him only, you know. That's why it says, honor thy father and mother in the Bible. Well, my mother, I told you, was a racist and a bigot. I don't know if you remember that. So I did not honor her in that area. When I brought a Japanese kid home, my mother said, I don't want that kind of sound. <coughs> Loud enough for the kid to hear it. You remember that? I did talk about that. Yeah. And so I used logic on my mother. I said, you don't know him, hear him out, get to talk to him, you'll find out he's a very nice person. My mother says, I don't want them around. Logic obviously doesn't work on people that don't know what logic is. But I said, Jack, I'm talking to myself. If you can't change your mother, you're not going to change the world. So I figured I've got to change my mother. So I told her a lie. As I was swimming in the East River, I think I talked about it. And I couldn't get ashore. This isn't true. There's a high wall in the East River. And I was drowning. And Masato, the Japanese kid, worked on a boat. And he threw a lifesaver to me. And he saved my life. My mother said, oh my God. She said, you mean he saved your life? Yeah. And I was very rude to him. I said, yes, you were. Please, Jock, ask him to come back. I want to beg forgiveness. That's my mother, you know. So I, I said, I don't know if he'll come back now to get her to plead with me. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. And she's pleading with me. I says, I tried to talk to you and you wouldn't listen to me. And she says, all right, I was wrong, which is great. Mm -hmm. Then I called Masato and said, when you come in the door, my mother wants you to come back. She wants to beg forgiveness, wants you to have dinner, you know, and all that. I said, when you come in the door, she's going to hug you and kiss you and bless you, because that's her background. You understand? Mm -hmm. I believe people react to the way they were brought up, not reasonable. Mm -hmm. No one is reasonable. We're all victims of culture, yeah. to a large extent, unless you read about other countries and talk to different people and travel and don't go to the American club, live with a French family or Italian family, get the feel of the culture. You find out they're all well like. They all love their kids, they all are nice people, If you, unless you come there angry, slamming yeah. on the pastor, Japanese, you know. We, that's the way we talk. We don't call Germans bad people, we call them krauts. I shot three krauts and it has a terrific, you know, Put some metal on you. That's why you don't feel bad. So, war I, I, and all that sort of stuff. So it's very difficult to step out of your culture. It is hard because you know somebody once said at a public meeting, "Jock, when do you get your next check from Moscow?" You know, you know, I get all that kind of stuff. Or you're a fascist or a communist or something. They don't know how to 
understand. They don't read, they just blurt it forth, you know. It says, they get it from the Bible, because in the Bible it says, there will always be war and rumors of war. I don't like that at all. You understand? And then when you see poor people, it says in the Bible, we shall always have the poor amongst us. I don't like that. Because I know we can outproduce mm. and turn out prefabricated houses. We can make safer cars so they can't hit each other. I know the Bible's wrong. It was Jesus never wrote anything, if you didn't know that. It's people that walk away and said, this is what Jesus meant, and that's where they disagree. So you get the loser in the seven day Adventist because it's subject to interpretation. I hope that what I say is not subject to interpretation because I'm trying to describe the detail.